I was six. I had a babysitter. It was about three times a week it would happen for three years. Um, three years of abuse, sexual abuse. She's had a really tough childhood. I think because it happened for so many years of my childhood, I thought whenever it happened, I thought for so long that it was normal. Charity in pain is distracted. She doesn't cry much, but occasionally she does cry, and then you know things are really, really bad. The darkest time of mine was, um, I think a little over a year ago, I was admitted to Phil Haven um, for inpatient because I tried to um, hang myself um, a couple times. I felt honored that she was able to talk to me about it, that she was able to open up and that we could begin to kind of move forward through some of the depression and the anxiety that she's experienced due to the sexual abuse. Because of Erica, I can definitely set boundaries and um, I definitely have more strength than I did. I don't let people walk all over me anymore. If it wasn't for Phil Haven and everything, I definitely think I would not be here. If you think about it as this was three years of my life, and I'm probably gonna to live to the age of 85. As you get older and older, you can either let that three years shrink and it becomes the size that it should be, or it can continue to be your entire universe. And I don't see Charity as somebody who's going to continue letting that be her entire universe. She's going to appropriately shrink it and let it take its place in her life as she moves on and builds a better future for herself.